Should we wake him up? I don't know. Look at that marker on his cheek. What about it? Remember that weirdo who used to clean the pool? When Dad came home and saw that guy had a mark on his cheek, he fired him. Dad said that mark meant he was in the facility. So you think this guy was in the facility too? Cool. That's not cool, you dork. People who've been to the facility are bad. Well, talk to his card spirits. See what they have to say about him. Well? They say that he's a very good person. They also say he's very sad. I wonder what he's sad about. Maybe he lost his dog or his hamster. Shh, he's waking up. Who are you? We found you in the alley downstairs. You wrecked your butt. You wouldn't wake up. So we brought you up here. You're heavy. My name's Leonard, but please call me Leo. This is my sister Luna. We're twins, in case you couldn't tell. Not identical twins, obviously. She's a she and I'm a he, mm. but... So, uh, who are you, mister? What's your name? I have no idea. anyone with amnesia before. Where are we? Check this out. Leo, just answer his question and tell him where we are. Cool, huh? It's on a motion sensor. We've also got a... You're in our apartment, in an area called The Top. Nice, huh? It's the best place in New Domino City. Only super rich people can live here. Leo? How did I end up in that alleyway? Did you hear what I just said? There may be a fugitive in there. I understand, sir, but again, all street-level officers wishing to enter the TOPS must present search and seizure form 23Q, which can be obtained by submitting an A-level warrant request to the district attorney and then, upon approval, presenting the intent blah, to Blah, blah, blah! You've got some satellite street rat in there wreaking havoc! Just let me in! All street-level officers wishing to nah. enter the TOPS must present search all and right, seizure form right. 23Q, which can so, be So, how'd it go? Jeeves over there treated me like I was some second-class citizen. I told you, Trudge, you gotta be an A-level detective in order to get in there without a hassle. Mm. These top security snobs actually think they're superior just because they guard the rich cats. But they're no better than us. What do you want to do about the kid? He's definitely in there, I'm sure of it. He's gotta come out eventually. There you go. Does that help any? <sighs> Now that you got your jacket on, take a deep breath and say, my name is, and then say your name. He's tried that 10 times. It's obviously not working, Leo. Well, it worked on TV. I saw this guy on a show one time. He was helping people remember things oh. they forgot, like where they left their keys and stuff. Hey, what you looking at? Those. Huh? Oh, that's my shrine. Jack Atlas is like my all time hero. He's the greatest. No one can beat him in a turbo duel. And one day I'm gonna be the champ, just like Jack. You can't even ride a normal bike. I stayed up for 12 seconds last time I tried. So does Jack Atlas mean anything to you? Yeah, but I don't know why. Maybe you're a fan of his too, or maybe you were hoping to duel him. I mean, you are a turbo duelist. How do you know that? Uh, because we found you next to that duel runner. Huh? Am I right about you? Are you a big time duelist in town to duel Jack? I don't think I'm a big time anything. Maybe you should try hypnotizing him, Leo. <gasps> I know! Huh. Mister, maybe you have one of these. I'll take it out. You tell me if it looks familiar. Okay. Well, does this ring any bells? The fortune cup? Yeah, it's this big tournament between a bunch of people Kaiba Corp randomly selected. It's gonna be huge! 
And hey, hey, get this! They selected me! I'm gonna be in it! Actually, they selected me. <gasps> Technically, they selected Luna, uh. but she's too scared to enter, so I'm gonna pretend to be her and enter and then win that thing. No one's gonna believe you're <gasps> me, Leo. <gasps> Why wouldn't they believe it? We're twins! We look just alike! I'm a girl. I'm pretty. Oh, we're makeup. Leo wears makeup! Leo wears makeup! You know what I think, Luna? You're jealous. Why are we even arguing about this? We still have a bad guy in our house. You don't know for sure that he's a bad guy, Luna. Maybe he was framed for a crime he didn't commit. That happens, you know. I saw it on TV once. Um, he's still in the room. Huh? Uh... Thanks for trying to help me and everything, but this fortune cup thing isn't ringing any bells. Huh? I should get out of here. Uh, where are you going? I shouldn't trouble you guys anymore. But you still don't know who you are. I got it. Just let him go, Leo. No, wait! Just, ah, uh, all right. Before you go, mister, I've got one more idea. I challenge you to a duel, Mr. Amnesia Man. He's got more important things to do. Uh, this could help him. I saw it on TV this one time. Jack Atlas was giving an interview and... Jack said that the way a duelist duels reveals who he really is. So if you duel, you might remember who you are. Come on, come on, come on, let's duel! Oh, dumb thing never stays on right. This is embarrassing, just, just give me a second. I'll, I'll fix, fix it up and we'll be good to go. go. Just hang on, I gotta jimmy the thing with the, put the... I think you're reminding me of somebody. I don't know who, but this might be good. Let's do this. You mean it? Disengaging dual disc. Sweet, good thing you remembered how to do that. Oh man, I'm gonna show you moves you've never seen before! Huh? Oh, come on. Uh... Let me help. So, where are your parents? Oh. They're on a really important business trip. They're always on important business trips. The hotel manager's in charge of us. We have tutors and stuff that come by every now and then, but so mostly So you don't we... remember who you are, but you remember how to duel? See, the thing about Luna is that she doesn't understand that not having our parents around all the time is the coolest. I see. Well, how's that? Uh, it's perfect. Thanks, Mr. Amnesia Man. What do you say? You ready to duel? You can have the first turn, Leo. Yeah! Oh. Ah, I should warn you, my deck rules! I'm sure it does. Here we go! Let's, Let's duel. duel! Ladies and gentlemen, the duel is on! The amazing Leo draws! That's what I'm talking about! I'm calling out Morphtronic Selfon! My Morphtronic special abilities change depending on whether they're in attack or defense mode. And since Morphtronic cell phone's in attack mode, it dials and randomly stops somewhere between one and six. Then I take that number and flip over the same number of cards. If any of those is a level four or below Morphtronic monster, then I can summon it. Here we go. <sighs> you okay? It appears that Leo's dual disc is a little heavy. You should know. He narrates his duels. We need silence in the arena, people! This is a critical moment! The cell phone is dialing now! And it stopped on three! The crowd is tense. Look at this! One of the cards the amazing Leo has flipped is a level three Morphtronic Magnet! That means he can summon it! The crowd goes wild! Awesome! Nice one! Yeah! Woohoo! When the monster card Morphtronic Magnon is in defense mode, your opponent cannot attack any other monster except this one. Next, I place one card face down and end my turn. And now, will Mr. Amnesia Man rise to the challenge? Sometimes I can't believe I'm related to him. 
I hope this jogs my memory. I summon Speed Warrior! And during the whole turn that Speed Warrior is summoned to the field, its attack points are doubled. They're doubled? That's right! Selvan is doomed! But wait, what's this, ladies and gents? The Amazing Leo activates a trap card! But will it be enough? Amazing! Leo used his Morph Transition Trap to put his Morphtronic Monster in defense mode so he could block the attack! I think my memory's coming back. Looks like Leo's already on the path to victory, people. There's no defeating him! It's a little early to get cocky. Just you wait. You're gonna end your turn now, right? I am. Well, in that case, I'm up! I draw! Ah. Maybe you need a smaller dual disc. No, I don't! From my hand, I summon another Morphronic Magnin. But this time, it's in defense mode! Pretty awesome. When there's one magnet on the field in defense mode, you can't attack any other monster. But this is an even better defense system because now on the field I've got two magnets, which means I'm invisible! <laughs> I think you meant to say that you're invincible. The streets are blocked. Get into position. Put your squad on the west gate. Check everyone leaving the building. Old ladies, everyone. Got it. Those sector security goons have got the building surrounded. And if you don't figure a way out, you say, you're going back to the facility for good. and no defense points is gonna help. I've gathered all the parts. Now for Datatron's special ability. By releasing one monster from the field, I can have Datatron dish out 600 points of direct damage. So by removing my gadget token, I can now attack you. Go Datatron Corruptor Cannon. He uses weaker monsters in ways you wouldn't expect. That reminds me of... I summon, I summon Sonic, Sonic Chick, Chick in defense mode! mode. I, I summon, summon out Speed Warrior! I summon Quillbolt Hedgehog in defense mode! I did it! I did it! I did it! I told you that combo could work, Luna, but you didn't think I could pull it off. But I did it! The crowd's going crazy for Leo's spectacular Morphtronic deck! Isn't it the end of your turn now? Oh, yeah, uh, got carried away. Make your move, Mr. Amnesia Man. Hmm. What's the status on the Fortune Cup? The invitations were mailed out as requested. Only one remains unsent. <laughs> I assume that one is you, Says. Where is he? He recovered his runner. But when he did, that officer Trudge was there and he chased you, Say, to the tops. Now Trudge has the place surrounded. Wasn't Trudge told to back off? Some people just don't listen. Perhaps I should go to him in person and remind him who's in charge before this situation gets out of hand. It's my turn. 
I send one card to the graveyard in order to activate the card rotator spell card. What's that do? Well, card rotator changes the battle mode of every monster on your field. Huh? As in all of them? That's right. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, we're seeing an awful turnaround. The Magnificent Leo <sighs> got hard to... Stop narrating, Leo. Just focus on staying in the duel. But I'm told... Not yet. Huh? But after I summon Junk Synchron, you might be. Uh, I am totally gonna lose. Well, with Junk Synchron in play, I can summon a level two or below monster from my graveyard in defense mode. So I summon to the field, Nitro Synchron. This means he can Synchro summon a level seven monster now. Nuh-uh. Yeah, huh? He's got a level three, a level two, and another level two. If you add them up, you get seven, which brings out a level seven Synchro monster. True, except that in order to Synchro summon, I can only use one tuner. Huh? Junk Synchron and Nitro Synchron are tuner monsters, so we can't use both of them. Huh? Watch and learn. I tune Junk Synchron with my Speed Warrior in order to bring out Junk Warrior. Whoa, man, that's pretty cool. And next, I tune my Nitro Synchron with my Junk Warrior. Now I'm going to rev it up with one of my favorites, Nitro Warrior. Nitro Warrior is a level seven fire attribute synchro monster with 2,800 attack points and 1,800 defense points. You said one of your favorites. Does that mean you remember who you are? Did it work? I knew it would, I knew it. I was- Hey Leo, get ready. Cause my Nitro Warrior's demagnetizing your magnet. I sure hope the amazing Leo is ready for an amazing move by my Nitro Warrior. The crowd isn't liking this. Well, then the crowd definitely won't like Nitro's special ability. See, when it destroys a monster in battle, it can switch one of your monsters in defense mode to attack mode, and then it can battle against that monster. Uh... So I'm switching your cell phone back to attack mode. Sorry, but yes way. Nitro Warrior, attack cell phone with Dynamite Crunch. Ah! Huh? Leo, don't cry when you lose. I'm not crying. Yeah, don't be upset. Dueling with you helped me to remember who I really am. So thanks. Thanks for helping me to get my memory back. Now, how about I give you a couple of pointers to say thank you for helping me out, Leo? Huh? See, you're a really good duelist, but by spending all your time and energy getting your monsters where you wanted them to be, you didn't leave room to anticipate any counterattacks. Your Morphtronic monsters can adapt. Now, you just need to learn how to do the same. Jack Atlas certainly can. Hmm. I thought you did really good, Leo. So, um... Are you going to tell us who you are? I'm not sure that's a good idea. Oh, come on, please! You see this marker? Trust me, the less you know about me, the safer you'll be. Okay, but if I don't know who you are, then how can I be your friend? I think that's kind of the point, Leo. He's saying he can't be our friend. Yes, he can. At least crash with us for the night, mister. It's getting late. Ah, that'll be awesome. And then maybe in the morning you can tell us who you are. Leo? What? <sighs> Just have come out already, you say?
I hate to duel and dash, you two, but it's for your own good. If I stick around here, you'll only get in trouble. think you didn't like me! I'm here to take you in, you say? Man, that guy never gives up. So, you're gonna come quietly? That's what I was hoping you- What the- And the plot thickens. Officer Trudge, aren't you supposed to be guarding the Candles and Calendars kiosk at the Outer Rim Mall? I didn't get your name, Shortstack. Special Deputy Lazar, I work for the Director General, and I outrank you. Sorry. <laughs> How come I've never heard of you? I'm on official business, Officer Trudge. I would advise you to leave the area immediately. This punk's a menace! He stole that dual runner from the inbound center! He's Officer! There's very little room in this city for street beat cops who don't know their place or when to shut their mouths. So what official business are you on? Delivery. For Mr. Yusei Fudo. <sighs> We'd like for you to participate in the Fortune Cup. If you refuse, the four people you see in that photograph will pay the penalty for the rogue actions you took in obtaining that runner. Have a good evening. Ha, 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 ha.